Hey what's up you guys, it's Jackson and welcome back to another video. So before I start this video, I am sorry I have not posted this week. I normally post on Wednesdays, that is my uploading day. But I was supposed to upload yesterday and I had a bit of an accident um, on the bus. I went to go get my hair cut, which I only got cut today. Um, I went to go get my hair cut, fell down the flight of stairs on the bus. Um, had to call an ambulance, was waiting five hours for an ambulance and I now have soft tissue damage in my body. But I'm good, don't worry. I'm fine sitting here to film the video today, so hopefully it'll be up the week that I was supposed to upload anyway, but yeah. So if you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below, and also if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, make sure to give it a thumbs up so I know what kind of content you want to see and what you want me to talk about, and etc. Okay, can you pass me my tea? <sighs> so for today's video, I want to talk about something, and you can obviously tell what I'm going to talk about from the title and if I keep spinning it's because I'm on a stool and I do this when I'm talking so I'm sorry. So yeah for today's video I'm going to be talking about uh, how I get misgendered like 99% of the time. Now it's really nice because like online and a lot of my friends they always tell me that I pass really well and they don't really see many feminine features like within this being um, and it's something that I kind of you know really do try to do. Um, but it is obviously quite difficult when I don't have any hormones, so. What up? But yeah, I do get misgendered like 99% of the time. Uh, people don't believe me when I say that, but I'm like, it happens. <laughs> An example is in work, I get misgendered by like 90% of the customers. Um, and that's actually like a fact, like 90% of people who, even the people who work with me, like they know my name is Jackson, but yet they still, like when they're referring to me, they're like, oh yeah, she'll serve you. And I'm just kind of like, what women do you know called Jackson? So yeah, that's pretty great. Um, also, it's just kind of like, it's mainly like small things, like people will either hear my voice for like a split second and maybe it's higher than usual and they'll be like, oh, like give your stuff to the lady and I'm like, bitch, wait. Me personally, I think I have a few feminine features but I don't think I'm like extremely feminine, um, which is just kind of, it's just annoying, like it's, annoying <laughs> there's no other word for it but yeah uh even on the bus like i said at the beginning yesterday he was asking for my name and i said that my name was jack and he was like is that short for jacqueline and i was like no like it's just it's i wouldn't like, i don't even know the words to describe but like it's it's not really offensive because like most of the people that misgender me don't know me so like unless somebody isn't is like intentionally misgendering me then i don't really get like offended by it but it is upsetting because I do feel like most of the time I feel like I'm passing and then when people say like, oh, like the woman or sorry, miss, or excuse me, miss, or, um, you know, serve the lady or let the lady serve you. It's kind of like, mm. but yeah, I didn't make this video for like pity or for people to be like, oh my God, but like you pass so well. That's so shocking. I made this video because like a lot of people would be surprised at how many trans guys like online will get misgendered in real life. Like. Yes, we don't get misgendered online. We do by some assholes who are intentionally misgendering us, which is offensive. Um, but like in the outside world, in the real world, not social media, um, I get misgendered, like I said, 99% of the time. Um, and I know a lot of my friends do as well, which is like shocking for me. And I get where they come from. Cause like, they're like, oh, people tell me I pass all the time. And then I get misgendered and it's like, same boo. I don't know. I think I just want to make the video to tell people that like, if you get misgendered, in public um, or by anybody and they don't know who you are or they don't know your story or they don't oh god your story that's so cringy basically if they don't know your life they don't know you try not to take offense to it and try not to jump down people's throats because people aren't educated like we are like i'm quite educated i wouldn't be extremely educated but i'm as educated as i'm trying to be um and yeah most people aren't educated about the lgbt community and it's great when people if you get misgendered and you're able to have the courage to correct someone and they are like oh sorry like had no idea i'll know from now on like when i get misgendered i literally don't stand up for myself like kate my girlfriend she'll like correct people quicker than i will and um, because i'm just shy and i don't want to cause a fuss and i like i know one day i won't be getting misgendered but like yeah i'm just don't don't be rude to people if they're not being intention if they're <sighs> what's the words for it don't be rude to people if they're not in, if they're not intentionally being rude to you. Like if it's unintentional, then like obviously they didn't mean it. They don't know you. Move on with your life. You're never gonna see them again. But like if someone walks over and they're like, you just say like, oh hey yeah, like this is my name now. Like this is the pronouns I go by. And they're like, yeah, no, you're still a woman or you're still a man. Like then you can be like, okay, bitch, back the fuck up. But if it's somebody who like walks past you or bumps into you and they're like, excuse me, miss, sorry, sir. Like it's 
it's just the way the world is and try not to take offense to it, that's the whole point of this video. So yeah, I'm a trans guy who apparently passes extremely well, um, but I'm misgendered 99% of the time and I've learned to deal with it and know that people don't mean it intentionally 99% of the time. So yeah, just keep that in mind. That's the moral of this video, that a lot of people aren't educated. So yeah. Sorry this video was short, um, or if it makes no sense, I just want to talk about it and just kind of get it out there that it's not all great. Everybody knows that anyway, being trans is no fun. If you enjoyed this video or if you have any video suggestions you want to give me, leave them down below. <laughs> One thing I do want to ask you guys, if you want to see uh, what I got for a Christmas video, I don't want to be that person that like brags about stuff or like I don't I'm not, I don't brag. Um, I just, I don't know if there's a video you want to see on this channel or something. I don't know. If you want to see any type of Christmas video, please comment them down below before Tuesday so I know when I can film something because I do want to film something around Christmas for this channel. I love doing Christmas videos. Christmas is a great time of year. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments down below. Subscribe if you're new, like if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next video. I hope you had, have, or having an amazing day. And if I don't see you before Christmas, happy Christmas. I love you guys. Stay safe and have a good new year. Peace.